Who that knock ain't not it. Yeah, I know it's been a while. Um, yeah, I've been feeling shit. And I've been to uni and I've been busy. And I'm feeling shit. I've been to uni. So, yo, what's up, guys? It's Nathan, and today we've got a brand new sneaker review. As you can tell by the title, it's the Ronnie Feig High Snob and Puma R698S uh, from the Tale of Two Cities pack. I do believe that this is the Berlin City side of the pack as opposed to the Blaze of Glory being the New York side of the pack. Just before we do get into the review, I've just got to quickly thank you guys for over 500 subscribers. 500. And over 50k views. That's just mental and it's all thanks to you guys. So a lot of people can agree or disagree that Ronnie Feig is overrated, stuff like that. I can honestly say he has got a few really, really good releases, some of which I have got in my collection. Uh, today I think this is a really good collaboration and although it's not been thrown out of the water, it's really, it's, it's impressive. It's basically Ronnie Feig and the head of High Snob basically collaborated for the 10th anniversary of the magazine, collaborating using their cities as the main story behind the collaboration. The guy from High Snob being from Berlin and obviously Ronnie Feig from New York. Clash them together and you got the Tale of Two Cities pack. Today we're going to be reviewing the R698S part of the pack, which is a reworked R698. Um, Ronnie Feig says he's reworked it and redesigned it, but he's basically just revised the eyelets and switched them up a bit and put a sock liner in it. And I'm not, to, I'm not like knocking his work or anything because it has worked, but redesign gives me more of a big scale impression rather than little things like that. I managed to get them in my car and check out in like 30 seconds, but the option for included custom charges and VAT didn't actually come up when I was buying it. So I ended up buying the uh, Express International Delivery uh, for DHL, which excludes custom charges and stuff, so I would have to pay it. For some reason when these came, I didn't have to pay it, so... <sighs> so basically, here's the box. Obviously, as I said, this is the Berlin side of the pack, so you have got the yellow, black and red from the German flag. Pretty impressive, um, I've got to say, honestly, it's a really, really impressive box. So basically, as some of you may or may not know, the reasoning behind the cut down the middle of the box is that it doubles up as a magazine holder. Obviously, High Snob is a magazine, online and in physical form, but a magazine holder does actually make sense and it really does create such a grand shoebox. <clears throat> Simple and just brilliant. <laughs> so as you can see here I got myself a UK7. I'm usually a UK 7.5 in most other brands. But the R698 does somewhat fit quite large so uh, I went down half size and I've already tried these on and they fit like a glove. Uh, so I would recommend going down half size if you're thinking about copping. So when you open the box you actually get a Ziploc bag with the shoes inside. So obviously unzip the bag which is High Snob and Kith branded as opposed to Ronnie Feig branded. As you can see there. And here we have the shoe. It's impressive. I, I just, I love it. Just the quality of this new book suede is unbelievable. And I don't, I don't, I don't. And I don't normally like quilting, but nah, this, <laughs> this is sick. So on the top of the sock liner, you've got the Ronnie Feig and High Snob logos in the uh, new book suede. Really, really nice hit, I do really like that. It's also got a little pull tab with a 3M hit on it that runs alongside the one running down the tongue. Speaking of 3M, on the Puma stripe, on the inside of the shoe, on both of the shoes, you have the German colours, which are actually 3M. So if you hit it with a flash, they will just go white and it just looks superb. Really nice, uh, really nice hit there. So it goes without saying that we have to talk about the black, red and black speckled midsole. Really, really dope, such a good colourway for the shoe. Uh, the outsole is your standard black and clear trinomic outsole. You've got the red hit here uh, on the front of the shoe, which looks really nice when it's on. One of my favourite parts of the shoe are the quilted leather midsoles. Really, really like it. You can see it says High Snob there, Ronnie Fight there, Puma, and the giant High Snob logo. Just cracking, really, really nice touch. Also, Ronnie Fag's known for his laces and rope lace love. Uh, you get three sets of laces with these, black ones that come already on the shoe. You have the black and white hit flat lace and the black and red hit flat lace, which uh, I'm not too fond of. I will be keeping the black ropes in as they just look fantastic in R698s all the time. Uh, but yeah, nice touch that he's giving you three options for laces, really cool. 
My overall opinion of the shoe, really, really dope pair. Fantastic quality, nice use of quilting. Like I said, I'm not really fussed. Probably my favourite part of the shoe is the sock liner. These do actually fit a lot better than normal R698s in my opinion. They actually do properly fit perfectly, um, half a size down. So, yeah, really, really impressed. Like I said, got a few Ronnie Fags releases. He's never been the most innovative fish in the sea. Um, not to say this is, but it's a really, really good end result. Really like some of the features on it. Um, let's do you an on foot. <laughs> Red Bull literally tastes like shit. I hope you enjoyed the review guys, I really really do like these shoes. I'd hold out on paying resale for them just now because there's still a few releases yet to come in Europe and a few other areas I think. Don't take my word on that though. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Also again, thank you for helping me surpass 500 subscribers. That's just mental. Um, I guess things only get better so. Just before the video ends, just a shout out to a few channels that have helped support my channel from the get go. Rain Mass Reviews, and he's shouted me out a few times before, so here's me repaying the favour. Um, Alex Maragakis, who's just doing fashion related videos and lookbooks, and they're really, really good. I think he's going to blow up soon because they're just quality videos, so I've put both of their uh, channels in the description, so be sure to check them out. And yeah, thanks again for watching. Peace.